I got her. I have her. Twenty years. <laughs> Am I too short, Scott? I'm on the picture. We met Philly. Uh -huh. At Wool Hands in um, King of Prussia. Oh my god, yeah. I got my roommates here. What happened? Yeah. 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 Once I left, you were with Bob. I was really like, if you wanted me to go down and have lunch with all the football players at the football table, then I didn't go. Yeah, I, you know, I just kind of figured out how to do it. Yeah, they have the extra nap. Actually, it's just, I think, the alumni association. It's summer. It's the last time. It's like football. down to yeah. um, Texas Texas, and we stopped in Annapolis and yeah. Chick Bolia, dad's friend we stopped and we took a tour of the Naval Academy and then he took us out on his boat and stuff do you remember that? That's when I first thought I might want to go there. That was with Planted the Seed? You know what really Planted the Seed? Was we still live in Long Island and dad went to like college night with Rock and he came back and he brought a, one of those catalogs from the Naval Academy and he gave it to me How old were you? And I was 10 wow. or 11. And then it wasn't until I went to Cistercian that I thought, wow, I could probably and get in. who was in. your sponsor? Well, football is what helped me get in. They have what are called presidential nominations for people they want to get in. So I guess it was Vandergriff, who was the congressman from, from Arlington. Go Navy? Go Navy. Yeah, Navy. Navy's got the ball back. Won't you let me stay? I just, my only hope is that I'd like to see Army perform a little better in the option. And if they do that, I think that the games would be better games. And uh, it would actually be better for the the rivalry because there really hasn't been much of a rivalry with N Navy having won seven of the last games. And I would say the average score differential right there. Right there. is yeah, like uh, about 30 points. So. Okay, so Scott, what's it like to come back here? How many years has it been, Chris? 20 years, 1988. Well, what's really nice. cool is coming back and seeing my brother when he was like not even dating you, I don't think, and no. now with you and three kids later. Three yeah. beautiful children. It's amazing. I'm very proud of my brother. He picked a beautiful wife Thank you, and Scott. he's raising some amazing children. I mean, amazing children. They're smart, they're um, sweet, 
they're strong, but they're, they seem humble, yeah. and they, there's a lot of love. You can see it in the kids. Can you Why smile you like a beautiful shoes? goddess you are? Why are you wearing those shoes? Because I'm a shoe guy. Hey, Will. Guess who won the game? Navy, 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 Navy. How'd you know? Because I was watching it. They really are very good. <laughs> you don't like to be on a camera? No. Or don't you want to be a Britney Spears? No. Can you sing a song? No. Can you dance? No. Can you say Om Namah Shivaya? No. Can you say yes? Now, I just want to say that I'm so proud of my brother Scott. And I'm just so honored that he came here for this weekend. And I don't want to run into the car in front of me. But uh, he, you know, he, he, he has a, a, a gentle soul. And I think he has... Gentle? Gentle. Wow. You have a gentle soul. And I think you have did love... The voice, did the voice teach you that? No, I think I'm being serious. You have, you have love at your core, and I think that's important. So if you have a gentle soul and you have love at your core, then I think you're uh, going to be able to make the most of your blessings. And I think your blessings are numerous, and you're magnifying them through your good works. That's all I want to say. Wow. That was beautiful. That's pretty good.